So Adobe is getting you to pay more money. So starting November 1st, everybody will be paying a little bit more. You're looking at a 2 to 3% increase for all of the creative apps, whether it's the Creative Cloud or if you plan on buying the individual. These prices are already reflected on their main pricing page. I live in Canada, so the prices will go up. You're looking at anywhere from two to three dollars. And if you look at these apps right here, like every year, there is a slight increase. Thank you, inflation. Thank you, economy. You also look at the Creative Cloud apps. This, from what I remember, was $60, $59 a month. Now, it is looking at $72 Canadian. 2 to $3 every month more. We're all paying more. But you're like, what does that actually get? What, what are we getting for this? Why is the price changing? Well, on top of the economy, Adobe is justifying their increases by because of things like AI, you will have access to Firefly, generative content, AI tools, and that will have more resources. So you're paying a little bit more because you will get AI features. But there's a catch. There's also Adobe is implementing credits like all these bigger AI software. You will get to use generative credits. So if you buy the plan, you get a thousand credits. And each time you use, let's say, an AI tool, you will deduct a certain amount of credits. And how you get to use more of these AI tools, guess what? Pay more money so you can use more of our tools. Scroll down here with all these AI tools within your uh, monthly app, you get a thousand credits per month. It does not carry over. This plan is still very new, but it, it was soon to be rolled out. As you can see, November 1st is when it will start to come into place. These credits do not roll over, which is kind of sucks. Meaning all the AI and the art that you create in your mind, it's almost like you have a cap. If I wanted to edit 10 videos, I would have to pay a certain amount of credits to use, let's say, Adobe Firefly. Right now, not so much of a huge, let's say, downfall, but if you were to rely a lot on AI, it's something to consider if you still stay within the Adobe Creative Cloud system. But if you're sticking around still to this far, there is a little bit of a hack. So every year when your plan has to renew, you can always click cancel. And once you click cancel, their automatic prompt will give you a little bit of a discount. But for all you hustlers out there, for all you content creators, you can always go to their support system and be like, if you ask, you'll never know if you don't ask. You ask, most likely they will give you a discount. You're welcome. So with all these updates, costing more money, creating more content, you need to justify, are you making enough content to offset those costs, especially if you are a freelancer, self-employed, or if you work in an agency. AI is coming, it's costing more money. What do you guys think? If you can get serious about content creation, learning content from yours truly, all my resources are in the link in the description below. You're watching Broke Vision Collective, where we all serve nothing, but you can always create something. Cheers, guys.